everybody and welcome back to Archer Adventures. If you're new here, my name is Jade Marie and don't forget to subscribe and stick around. We'd love to have you. We are very close to 200 subscribers, so please help our little family grow. Okay, so I've actually just this second finished videoing um, a What's In My Bag Heart Mum edition. So please go and watch that first because a lot of the things that are in my bag I obviously carry day to day, so they are in that video, not in this one. And I'm obviously wearing the same clothes because I've literally just filmed it. So... <laughs> This has been filmed on the same day, no hating on the matching outfits. <laughs> okay, so when we're doing a day out or a filming day or anything like that, we obviously have the basic stuff that I carry around day to day, and then this will be the extra things that I carry. So, first off, I take a tripod. Obviously, I'm currently using it, so I can't show you it, but it's just a cheap one from Primark. Nothing fancy, it was literally four pounds. And the next thing I carry around, sorry for people that hate these, but I have a selfie I don't stick. I really use it as a selfie stick. I use it more as like just a way to hold the phone a bit steadier than if I was holding it like this so I carry that around this is a new item to my um, going out bag but I've got this waterproof pouch and Dawn Louise has one too as she has an iPod that is four years old and it's lasted this long so hopefully this will keep it going but Dawn Louise has a pink one but yeah it comes on a lanyard um, which I'm gonna make smaller because then I can probably have it close to my chest and film um, like water rides and stuff um, with my phone. The next thing I carry on days out is a headband. This is just in case we go on like a water ride and then my hair gets really wet and I want to get it off my face and let it dry. That goes on quickly. Then, as we are vloggers and also a family and want to capture memories anyway, I have my extra two cameras. This is my Canon bridge camera. Um, I got this a couple of years ago. It is a sx 400 is i don't know what any of that means but i've got one um but the zoom on this is incredible and it is so amazing and i use this at theme parks before and i can get right in on the person who's on the ride um if it's a ride that i'm not on so i love using this to capture those funny moments of people going on rides and then my new little friend is my little action camera this is a cam park it was only 40 pounds um there is another video on our channel uh with me opening this and explaining all of it to you but yeah i'm really excited to use this because i now have in my bag a chest mount for it so we're going to be able to not only do um like normal ride shots with this we can do water rides with it um, and get like a perspective thing where we, so I'm not holding it and shaking all over the place. <laughs> now we're actually gonna go onto the snacks, the most important part of a day out. So start off rather healthy. The first two things that I take for my daughter are grapes, because she is addicted to them, <laughs> um, and fruit yogurts. These are great for when you are in the line and just want a little snack quickly. And they normally have bins in the line, so it's, it, but if not, we can just roll these up really easily and put the rubbish away yet later. I bought her a pre-cut packet of carrot batons. She loves these as a little snack, so these are quite handy because they don't take up too much room in her lunch Next up, I got her a Peppa Pig Pez. And I thought this is so funny because part of where we're going, um, has like a Peppa Pig themed area so I thought that would be really funny for the train journey. So I've never actually tried this before so I'm really excited to see how it goes but I bought one of these Robinson's squashed juices. Um, I'm not sure how long it will last or how strong they are. Oh it says up to 20 drinks so yeah this will just be a good way for us to save a bit of money because we can just get some uh, drinkable tap water and then add this to it. Next up on the snack train is pocket raisins. She loves grapes so obviously that means she loves raisins too. And then we always take a multi packet of crisps because they're easy to take and they're kind of like a picnic essential um and because we have to go on a train for an hour taking an actual picnic basket would not be ideal so we take these and then just make up a lunch ourselves now i actually made a mistake with this i needed a bottle to take with me tomorrow and i didn't really want to spend like three pound on a piece of plastic so i decided to get a voss water bottle not only did i not realize they're made of glass because i ordered it online but it's huge <laughs> And I literally just wanted it for the bottle. Um, but it was only a pound, so I was like, I wasn't expecting it to be this big, but it's so heavy because it's glass. So yeah, I'm not sure if I'm gonna take that or not because it is really, really heavy. Now, because Dawn Louise is technically medical fragile, which means that she needs to try and keep away from germs as much as possible, um, I have a little bottle of antibacterial and this is just for us to use getting on and off rides because so many hands are touching them day to day and at the moment a lot of people around us have colds so this is definitely an essential. Now, my best friend's come with us and we all go a bit mad for these so I got some cereal bars because I don't know why but we always love having these to eat in the queues so... And yeah. then the last things which are really boring is a tub of gum because that 
but I always find it helps me if I get feel like I'm dehydrated. This just makes me feel a little bit better until I can go and get myself a drink if I'm like on a ride or something. And then some sandwich bags because I make us our own packed lunches. So yeah, it's not the most exciting bag in the world, but I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. We love talking to people. So yeah, if you have anything at all to say, comment below and we'll be sure to get back to you and we will see you in the next video. Bye. Everybody gives you advice, yeah. On how to live your life, how to live your life Don't you know that life is full of surprises You better realize, better